it then again be in Machado and uh, I kind of thought that they were both were going to win those matches but the other two were won so I mean, yeah they put up a good yeah they put up great probably. matches yeah there's not really much to go on I haven't been able to find a lot of highlight uh, reels or anything footage from them but they put on a good first fight even though they lost Kiever started off with a big knee and there goes Abby with a knee Oh, Kira just clipped her in the uh, clipped Abby in the back knee there, back of the knee. Oh, she caught the kick, locking on leg lock. I'm not really sure how this one will go. It could go either way, but I know Nuno, Abby Nuno's was very impressive in her first fight. She yeah, kind of went up against somebody who was. Just a little bit better than her that night. Yeah, Abby's got some impressive combos. Key was, oh, nice leg lock by Kira, but Key was gonna have to defend against those combos if she stands a chance here. Yes, this is like a anything's go, anything goes match. <clears throat> well, a federation of promotion. There's no rope break, no TKO. We go five rounds for five minutes each. And these t these two uh, ladies are from our Film Fatal division. Basically, kind of treating it like a like an underground fighting show, like a blood sport or Mortal Kombat, something yeah. of that nature. Yeah. Exactly. Kiva with a leg hook, still can't get a submission. Big kicks by Abby Noons there, and she's going for Achilles hold. A lot of our characters from our wrestling brands, our shows are tied into this as well. Like Kota Kinzo, this is this whole deal right here is happening because of Kota Kinzo and our the owner of SWA, the Texan. Kota Kinzo has a prize fighter named Sanuk Kapal. Who is the red strap champion in Japan, and so that's what this whole show is basically based around right now. Yeah, this was created by uh, Coda and the Texan to make extra money on the side. Big combo there by Abby. This is basically the underground of SWA. Yeah. Where all the dirty stuff happens. You may see people pull out a DVD, power bombs, but you'll also see some regular MMA fighters, you know, submissions and stuff. Big punches there. They all fight for money? Yep. What is it, $500? I do believe that's what it said. Every win gets some $500, and fight of the night gets 2000 I believe. Nice headlock there, but Kira, but she's got to do more than that. Oh, big head kick. I do believe, see, I remember seeing that uh, Abby Nunez, she was mainly a kickboxer, and you could tell. Yeah, she's got that, that kickboxer, Holly Holmes uh, style vibe about her. Yeah. Big knees there by Kira. Both of these women look to pick up their first win here on the sanction. Yep. Master Yoshi's got to give a standard 10 count here. Can Kira get up? No, it is over. Way to redeem yourself. Yep. That was a good way to redeem herself from her first loss. Yeah, I believe we might be looking at a future contender for that Ben Patel championship. Oh, yeah, I think so, too. I'd like to see her in a rematch against um, Andrea Blaze. 
they were de 